previously during the investigation. These puppies are making me go to another town in the boondocks again. I didn't think you'd keep me waiting in the rain for so long. Welcome. I'm the sheriff, George Woodman. Call me George. There's definitely something in this town. Do you feel it, Zach? My coffee warned me about it. <gasps> it's broken. Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to Tenthile Gaming. As always, I hope you're doing well today. My name is Tenthile, and we are continuing Deadly Premonition. I hope you enjoyed episode two. Uh, it got weird. Things are about to get weirder. I am very sure of that. What is up with these chairs? Take item. Okay, I guess I'm just going to take that then. I'll take my bonus. Thanks. There's oh, there's two doors. Well, that one isn't open though. So I am thoroughly enjoying this playthrough. I again, I hope you are as well. I'm excited to see where this game goes. I, I really am, especially with how weird it is. And I, I also hope that we fix the audio enough <laughs> so that it's not a huge pain, but that may not be the case. I did figure out how to change stuff, which is very nice. Your. Who's that? Oh, is that the kid in the little picture? I, I didn't even look. We'll say hi to him. York. Say hi to him there, bud. Don't breathe. Hold your breath. They can't see you if you hold your breath. Okay. Hurry. Like this. Cover your mouth. Okay. I'm holding my breath. Well, not anymore, because that would be annoying. I can't believe this is a feature in the game. I mean, I, I totally can. I totally can. Hot damn, this game is super weird. I'm still holding my breath, are you kidding? Are we just gonna walk past, or...? That guy gonna do the limbo? What are we doing here, bud? Nothing, huh? How long would you like me to hold control? Oh, and my breath, sorry. Did I break the immersion, guys? Hope not. Hope not. Hit that like button. Subscribe. Did that break the immersion? <laughs> Weird. Who oh, I can stop hitting the button. You? He's the doorkeeper, of course. See? He opened that door. How beautiful was that? Beautiful. Another lollipop. I have not touched any of the, the lollies. Oh god, was that a dream? That was a trippy dream. Man, I've had some trippy dreams. What is this bed? Is that like super king size or something? Uh, anyway, I've had some weird dreams, but nothing quite like that. Pretty close. What is, again, back onto this bed. What is this bed? Zach, is that a California king? The symbolism in my dreams continues to intensify. Mm. A forest of red trees. A carpet with red leaves. A strange doll. And twin angels. But that child is what bothers me the most. That's what bothers you the most? I swear I've seen him before. 
I just can't remember where. Really? Well, that'll probably come back to me eventually. For now, we need coffee. That's what bothers him the most. Let's head to the cafeteria, Zach. I hope they have some real coffee. I really need some coffee. Then we can head to the sheriff's office. Okay, hold There's a proper hold procedure for everything, there, right, Zach? Zach? Hold that thought there, Zach. When you hit escape, you can go to the menu here. So I'm going to fix some settings, and then we'll be right back. Thanks for watching. And we are back. Those settings all nice and changed. We could sleep. We could change our clothes. We're not going to do either of those things. We've got progress to make. Didn't you know? Hold on, what's in here? That's our toolbox. Did we regain health? Take items out. First aid kit. Oh, I guess, I guess I don't need it. Never mind. R, cancel. Back. There we go. I hope that sound is much better. We'll see once we hit some of the, the dialogue if that's all good or not. What's in here? Oh, that's the potty room. We can shave. Damn, we don't we don't have time for this. We've got a mystery to solve. We've got things to do, game. We'll shave later. Out of the room. I love that we can shave. Oh god, I guess we just go this way. I don't appreciate that arrow, but... You know what? I guess. I guess we need it, Ro. We can get food and stuff. That's neat. Go in this room. What's the worst that can happen? Come on, York. What was that move Good morning, right Mr. there? Morgan. Your breakfast is ready for you. What the frick was that? Thank you, Mrs. Polly Oxford. Oh Just Polly is my fine. My God. Thank you, Polly. I'm starving. <laughs> is everything all right, Mr. Morgan? How is this table? Admire. Yes. It's delicious, of Polly. My compliments to the chef. I'm hoping my cooking will bring back repeat guests. Honestly, so though, much for fixing that audio. Sorry. Stayed here. I couldn't help but notice. Aside from you and <laughs> it me, doesn't there matter. seems to be no other guests or workers around. What's that? The salt's in that white shaker there. Thank you. I was wondering if there were any other guests or workers here. Oh, me no, too. No one else. My husband and I used to run this place, but he 
He's in heaven now. You've been working here alone since then. Creepy. Must be hard by yourself. Oh my. We're all out of pepper. I'm very sorry. It must be difficult to run a hotel by yourself. Well, yes, I suppose. I could just live Playing my into pension. that old lady but stereotype admit, here, huh? Running a hotel is kind of like a hobby of mine. That's nice. Polly, it might help to hear you better if you could sit a little closer. Oh my, Mr. Morgan, you're embarrassing me. So early in the day, too. I think I'm a little too old for you. And I still love my departed husband. May God what rest his What did she soul. think he said? I appreciate the invitation, but I'm fine over here. Polly, I can hardly hear you from all the way over there. You're exaggerating. This is fine. It won't do. I can't hear anything over the music. For such a large table and cafeteria. We have to make use of all this space. <sighs> now tell me, that wound on your face. What happened? Let's just say I had some trouble during the last case I was working had on. Had some trouble. I'm sure it'll heal. It's flesh just a wound. flesh wound. Oh my. It's okay. Well, there's no need to be the tough guy here. I want you to be Everything's able to good. relax here. I've prepared a special room for you. A famous rock star once stayed in the same room, you know. Really? I feel honored. If you need anything, anything at all, just let me know. I'll help you out in any way I it can. It was him. Zach, the lady is offering to help. Do you want to ask her about the town? Say, Polly. Heck yeah, ask. What can you tell me about this town? Well, let me see. You might oh, he lights already, a cigarette. Oh my god, he's got so much Bay. sass and pizzazz. quite often. But oh it's a nice boy, place. we're in for it here, Surrounded guys. With nature. We're it in was for a big it. And prospering lumber town until not Cue so the music. Long ago. We used to have a population of over 6,000 people. Less than a tenth of them left now. This hotel was built back then. We saw plenty of guests in those days. That's why this place is so big for such a small community. I have so many fond memories. Fix that sound issue, you're welcome. Clock? Oh yes, it's lovely. Breaking the fourth, fifth, the sixth, and seventh and eighth walls. Oh, those are real. You'll hear it many times during your stay. It's a beautiful <laughs> sound. You're you welcome. Too, I, think. I look forward to hearing it then. Anything else you'd like to know about? No. Of oh, shops. Tell me about them shops. What kind of shops do you have? Did I not ask about the shops? Game? L U L? Yeah, look at look with interest. Yeah, look into the coffee. We're going in, guys. Let's go. <laughs> Did you see that, Zach? Clear as a crisp spring morning. F K in the coffee. I knew I could count on it. It never fails. Now then. Art night? Let's get going. Hmm. Weird. Very weird. Why is my sleep thing a deer? I don't even know. I kind of want to just explore. I feel like I'll break the game, though. Ba -na -na, ba -na -na. I love that music. It's so good. Can I get more coffee? I bet I can. This game is super janky. I love it. Love it. I really do. It's so good. Now if it could only fix... Of its other silliness would be would be good to go. Hold on, how is she running this place herself? Are you? I mean, there's nobody here though. Is there no one here? Oh, what's this? Can I watch TV? Anything in the? I got to stall something with the microwave. Uh, Check the weather. Today is a fine, clear day. A perfect day to have a walk. Um. 
You're welcome. I moved my face so you could see that little bit of extra text. Again, you're welcome. Checking the weather. Always be prepared, York. Always be prepared. We're not even going to talk to her. We're just going to go. We can talk to her right there. What? First day of an investigation. Cleared time. Oh, okay. Did we already do that part? Do I want to save? Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Of course I want to save. Who doesn't want to save? Oh, save the game! Oh, sure. That too, that's fine. A police car. Very astute observation, York. From nine to seven. Yeah, beautiful. Beautiful. Grab that key, Sheriff George Woodman. Don't be late. So we have King George to thank for preparing a car for me. A pleasant surprise, eh, Zach? Let's take it for a spin. His mannerisms are driving me insane. I have to tell you, Zach, this place simply amazes me. The keys were left on the front hood, and nobody stole the car. Oh, well, that's a small town. This town has what the country needs. Values. Let's head over to the sheriff's department. Oh my god, I get to drive the car? Page up? Why are there so many commands? Are you kidding? I'm not going to remember all this. I know how to steer and accelerate. You got master key. You got flare. Going out on the open road. I have to manage gas? Are you kidding? The sweet jazzy music, too. Beautiful. Well, bet you guys didn't think you're going to be on a road trip. Little did you know. We're on a road trip. Let's go. I don't know where we're going. I didn't see what the horn button was. So, Zach. About those bonus features in DVDs nowadays. Movies <laughs> from the 80s have almost no bonus material. Even if they do, it's a trailer and the visual quality is pretty bad. Though that visual quality is a good reminder of those days. So many new Going this way. visual appliances. Sorry, did I cut you off? Then. Do you remember the first video deck we Awkward. bought? Awkward. We bought it to record I'm talking to Star myself Wars here on TV. And remember when that video store opened, we spent hours there. Not through speed limits. Just trying to find a good movie to rent. There weren't that many to choose from back then. I remember renting some really bad ones after reading those back cover taglines. Hey, remember? Attack no. The Killer Tomatoes, filmed in 1978. Yeah, I do remember that movie. Directed, That's a bad movie. And edited by John DeBello. It was really awful, but for some reason I still remember it pretty well. It had so many sequels, and the original was re-released in 95. The 87-minute long theatrical release bumped God, up to that was a bad movie. minutes. But that was around the time I joined the Bureau. Oh my I god, I'm all over the road. I know, Zach. Once this case Sorry, is over, you're getting past. I bet we can buy a copy on the internet pretty easily. Oh, there's like a race there? Get out of here. I'm here to detect. Not race. I put that behind me. We made it. I only cut like six people off. That's pretty good. All the skills and tips and tricks we earned in That's one Grand Theft Auto for such a small town. The exterior woodwork is spectacular. Don't you agree, Zach? 
No, Zach doesn't agree. Zach, chime in. Zach? Zach? Zach's not talking to me today. Weird. Oh my god, that... <sighs> so good. We started all deadly do right. Oh my goodness. Pleasure to meet you, Agent Morgan. We've been expecting you. I'm Thomas McLean, the sheriff's assistant. Is this game a walking meme? Walking FBI talking Agent Francis York Morgan. Meme. Please just call me York. It's what everyone else calls me. Holy Very well crap. Known, Agent Agent York. I believe I owe you a thank you for retrieving my belongings from my car. Thanks. Oh, no, no. Just doing my job. I just, look, I want to help do everything I can to help the investigation. I just can't believe Anna was murdered. She My was brain's such a about to explode. And lovely girl. Did you know her well? Well, no, not really. But it's a very okay. small town. I'm sorry. It's just that this is the first really big case I've ever seen. Clearly. I understand. Just try to relax. Can I have a look at Anna's file now? Y yes, of course. The sheriff told me to let you through to the meeting room, but I lost the key to the cabinet where the files are. All right. Why don't you take a look around while I go look for it? Okay. Let me know when things are ready. Unacceptable. What is that? Zach, Thomas appears to be the kind and sensitive type, totally at odds with the monarch. Almost a good setting oh. for a cartoon. Oh my god. It's a meme within a meme. The memes have memes. Oh, I can save here? Alright, well let's take a quick look around first. Before we do that. What's going on in this locker room? Oh my god, we can... Take this item. What is it? Long-tailed flying squirrel keys. Oh, I was hoping I could pump some iron. Darn. I can't pump any iron, huh? I can change, though. That's neat. See? Pays to discover and explore. Kitchen room. And you know we're going to go in there. What do we have here? Dumbbell? Zach, there's a name written on this dumbbell. What? Arnold. <gasps> I haven't met anyone by that name yet. Could it be the owner of this dumbbell? Definitely. What do you think, Zach? Mr. Universe? Arnold? Are you in this game? The Governor? Oh, the Governor! Just when you think this game can't get any weirder, it does. I'm thinking it wants us to go that way. But man, talk about getting good and weird. I, I, mm. I just don't even know. Can I do the move right here? That'd be great. I'll do it for you guys one last time. That's going to do it for this episode. I, oh my goodness. This game is getting weird and I think it's going to get even weirder. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Get the comments down below your thoughts about this series three episodes in and it's just getting crazier and crazier if you want us to increase the length of the episodes definitely let me know we can make them a little bit longer i don't really want to make them too much shorter but definitely let me know the all the details down in those comments and i hope to see you again here soon on 10th Isle gaming my name is been 10th Isle. hit that subscribe button and that like button on your way out meow and have a
Have a good day.